morning your majesties welcome back to my youtube channel for those of you that are new here welcome to my youtube channel uh, before i get into today's video i want to congratulate you guys because you guys made it to friday so congratulations <laughs> okay this story is called well i don't think it okay uh it's a ghost story so it says, it says, when I was in my late 20s, I was dating my girlfriend, soon, soon to be wife. We had been together for a while. One summer, her sister was abducted and killed by a group of six men. Alrighty, let's start reading. All the men were eventually caught and tried. The trials and the aftermath were devastating and deliberating for the family, for the family for many years, for many, many years. Fast forward to three months after the funeral, I arrived at my girlfriend's house to wait for, to wait for her to get off from her job as a nurse at a local hospital. Neither of her parents were home just me alone in the house. I went into the family room, turned on the TV, sat down on the couch, and got comfortable. Clear as a bell, I heard my girlfriend's sister's voice in my right ear, just off my shoulder, call my name. I turned to look at the seat next to me, and of course, there was nobody there. I stared at the spot in the couch next to me, for a long while that's creepy okay I'm going to read you guys one more I once saw a creepy reflection of myself at the end of the hallway in a friend's apartment building this one's really short so later that night when I asked about the weird mirror he told me there were no mirrors in this hallway, in his hallways. That's creepy. Okay, one more. Uh, during the time my grandma passed away, my husband and I were having a lot of money problems. Okay. A few nights after her, wait, a few days after her funeral, I started to dream about her. She always told me in my dreams that if I needed money or if I needed money for anything, I should just check under the under her mattress. I ignored the dreams, but they kept repeating again and again for weeks. So I decided to take a look under her mattress, and guess what? I found one thousand and fifteen hundred and Mexican pesos. I have not dreamed about her once since I found that money. Wow. Okay. Um, all right. I'm going to leave it here. Um, so if you're new here, hi, I'm Princess Peyton. Hit the red button to become your majesty and hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I upload a video. And I love you guys so much. You guys are the best human beings ever made. And you're the king of my heart and the song lyrics of Taylor Swift. And I will see you guys on Monday's video. Okay, love you. Bye. Mwah.